good to go. Congratulations. As leader of the stage, you've been selected as this year's contestant for Genki Bowl 7. Please meet us as soon as you can, and good luck to you. An entire soda bottle? K-12, 97.6. I don't know what happened. I lost my job, my wife left me and took the kids. Next thing I knew, I was sleeping in a bus station doing coke off of toilet seats. I guess you could say I'd fallen on some hard times. I didn't know where to turn. <laughs> you lost to the Shit. best. Good one. <laughs> by design. Dr. Richard helped me change everything about my parents. I went from a six foot five Caucasian man with green eyes and blonde hair to a five foot four Asian man with no teeth. Dr. Richard is a genius. He saved my life. Now when I rip off a pizza joint or smack around a hooker while hopped up on crank, I do it knowing no one will ever suspect the tiny toothless Asian. Hi, I'm Dr. Richard. Everybody makes mistakes, right? But that... Give you that chance. No judgments, no questions asked. That's our guarantee. Image by design. There's always time for a new you. Sports fans, and welcome to the craziest, wildest, bloodiest extravaganza outside of Jorez, Genki Bowl 7. I'm Zach, and you all know my tag team partner, Bobby. Bobby, previous Genki Bowls have had no lack of surprises. Of the nastiest sort, Zach, and this year will be no different. Murder, mayhem, and fun are all just a big part of any Genki Bowl, and the genius man-cat has cooked up an exciting list of never-before-seen events that promise to be even deadlier than anything we've ever seen before. Oh, hey, worse than the Grizzly Bear Rodeo from Genki Bowl 4? There is absolutely no doubt about it. <laughs> wow, I'm actually salivating. Oh my goodness. And as an added bonus, Bobby, we've just learned that the leader of the Third Street Saints will be taking part in today's festivities. Think they can keep the winning streak going, huh? We're about to find out. The games are going to begin, so let's get down there. And when I say down, we mean down to the action. Off now. Here we are, Genki fans, at Apocalypse Genki. Today's match was created by the Angry Tiger, putting her own spin on the classic super ethical reality climax. That's right, Bobby. And I hear there's new things in store for our oh, mascots. I think Tammy can fill us in on that. Tammy? Thanks, Bobby. 
in the deepest, Cash and darkest Dockett. corners of the jungle lives a great warrior. Protected by fierce traps and mascot bodyguards, she... Whoa, whoa, hold on there, Tammy. What are you doing? Um, reading the script Angry Tiger handed me. She handed you a script? And the best part's coming up. <laughs> she keeps her minions in line through the threat of shark-infested waters. So beware. All who enter the jungle of the Angry Tiger! Well, that was entertaining. Thanks, Tammy. Oh, you're welcome, Zach. Amazing. Sharks are a new addition to the Genki wheelhouse. Looks like those mascots better hope they don't fall in. Cash in pocket! like that one. Ethical! We don't see a contestant dominate an arena like this often. Extended reality! behind the scenes, Tammy. I just spoke with one of the mascot trainers, and he expressed his apprehension at the new... Uh oh That sounds <laughs> like a hunter! <laughs> Spectacular performance! requested that you escort him to the Genki Bowl publicity appearances. However, he can be a bit uh, eccentric. See if you can get him all charged up to meet his fans. Ball fans, Zack and Bobby here bringing you some exciting Genki Ball updates from the genius Professor. That's right, Zack. We've just received word that Professor Genki has decided, in honor of Genki Ball 7, to make a public appearance on the streets of Steelport. And I also hear that the Master of Ceremony will be escorted by none other than our current Genki Ball frontrunner, the leader of the Saints. If you want to meet the genius behind the epic extravaganza of bloodshed and carnage, then head to Leather and Lace. And while you're there, go ahead and pick up a gimp suit for that special someone in your life. That's all from us. We'll be back later with more coverage from Genki Ball 7. You know, I could use a gimp suit. Get the fuck 
out of here!
you're fucking with? Playlist for my super big house party this weekend. It was a huge meeting too, because my computer was being all crazy. You know how that goes. You are listening to 97.6. This is K12, and I am T-Roy, your master of the tracks. T-Roy, I'm about to test drive my very first Zemos. Give me a song for the occasion. You have great taste. I've owned a few Zemos convertibles and loved every one of them. So what can you play for me? Got any Kevin Seaton? Kevin Seaton? Great choice. Take your test drive to the sound of Step Down. And be sure you pay cash. Those interest rates will kill you. just can't fight. Welcome, Genki Ball 7 fans, to the latest and greatest contest of guts, gore, and glory, courtesy of that crazy cat man, Professor Genki. That's right, Zach. In today's show, we're with a very special surprise. Professor 
Mr. Genki's very old Genki girl, Sexy Kick, has designed a brand new game for oh Tetris to play. And what a game it is! Here to tell us more is our correspondent down on the streets, Tammy Tolliver. Tammy. Thank you, Zach. Our contestant will have to maneuver a giant ball of yarn throughout the city and cause as much damage and mayhem as they can before time runs out. A giant ball of yarn? Looks like Sexy Kitty definitely put her paw print on this show. Oh, <laughs> and that's not all, Bobby. The ultimate goal is to catch the mouse. Do that, and the contestant will score big. A mouse and a ball of yarn, huh? Is something the matter? No. Just sounds like my friend's bachelor party. Well, uh, I don't think I want to know. You really don't, Zach. We never did find that mouse. Dissolve the Earth! With the destruction and explosions our audience is seeing here today, Professor Genki must be really pleased. As the second event for Genki Bowl 7, I can't see how he wouldn't be, Zach. Sexy Kitten has really put together a great show. Oh, and there's more to come, Bobby. Another match full of yard and carnage. This will be a Genki Bowl for the record book, Zach. The Genki girls are certainly going all out in their designs. And the Saints head honcho is certainly going all out on this course. Ain't you wonder if they always drive around like this? No need to wonder. I've seen this celebrity on the street, and let me tell you, nothing is safe when the Saints roll by. Then how are they still allowed to drive in Steelport? Would you like to be the officer who asks the Saints for their license and registration? I don't think so, Zach. Especially given the number of times they've been accused of grand theft auto. I doubt any registration would be in their name. I doubt they ever even had a license. I can still got it. Has planned the next. Guess what? The professor thought you did such a fantastic job. He wants you to drive again. Remember, don't look him in the eye unless you want to wake up in a North Korean prison camp. You know who you're fucking with?
Hey there, Get Cable fans. Are you ready for another surprise? So Courtesy of Professor Genki himself. After his last public appearance, Genki has decided to stir up his adoring yet bloodthirsty fans yet again. And of course, the leader of the Saints, the champion so far here at Genki Ball 7, will be accompanying him. I heard last time the crowds were ablaze with excitement. Literally, some people left for third degree burns. <laughs> Nothing like a little calamine lotion won't fix. So, sports fans, if you want to catch a glimpse of the genius man cat, hurry on down to Planet Saints right now. And don't forget to tune in for the next event here at Yankee Bowl 7. No one beats a saint. How's the crew sound? in. Man, we gotta get a new place. That studio shit ain't working at all. Oh, spent too much time in posh hotels? <laughs> I can't help it that the rest of the world treats the Saints right. Doesn't mean we should get soft. I hear you. Listen, how about you and me roll around the city and see what Steelport has to offer? You convince me. Just meet me at the park. I'll pick you up.
was easy. This car could use a little tuning. Let's find the rim jobs and get it cleaned up. Shandy's taking this thing with Gant pretty hard. And we all are. I know, but you're always pissed off. A girl's not as crazy as you. Don't worry, I'll keep an eye on her. Where you rolling with Gat anyway? Long time. He was there when I first joined the Saints. Shit. What was he like back then? He mellowed with age. Until Aisha died. Then he was fucking pissed. These guys have been around since the late 1980s. Gotta admire that. That was Ken Lass on the blood. Cars got some more style. Now it's our turn. Head to Planet Saints. I don't know, man. That's like wearing the band's T-shirt to the concert. Nothing wrong with wanting to look good. I always look good. We need some driving music. See if you can find something good. Dude, you gotta be crazy if you don't feel empowered after listening to that. <laughs> oh shit! Turn yeah. it up. You remember this? Come on. This was like, this was my high school, right? Early in the morning, uh, rising to the street. Light me up that cigarette and I strap shoes on my feet. What? Got to find a reason, a reason things went wrong. Got to find a reason why my money's gone. Gone cause you stole it. Uh, I got a Dalmatian. Got a Dalmatian. And I can still get high. I still get high. I, I can, can play, play the guitar like a motherfucking riot. <laughs> life is too fucking Come on, man. Get into it. Come on. Come on. But life is too short, so love the one you got Cause you might get run over or you might get shot Never start a static, I just get it off my chest Never had to battle with no bulletproof vest Take a small account, take a tip from me and me Take all your money, give it all to charity And any love that I got is within my reach And the suburb I style straight from Long Beach Comes back to you, you find a what you deserve Try to test, 
understand You bound to get served Love what I got Don't start a riot You feel it when the dance gets hot Sing it Loving is what I got I said remember that Loving is what I got I said remember that Loving is what I got I said remember that Loving is what I got I cry when my dog runs away. I don't, I don't get, get angry at the bills I have to pay. I don't get angry when my mom smokes pot. Hits the bottom and goes right to the rock. <laughs> Fucking and fighting is all the same. Little do we dogs, the only way to stay sane. Let the loving, let the loving happen. Oh, you act like How awkward would it be if we pulled up right next to somebody at a red light? Come on, man. Last course, ready? Uh, you can do it. Come uh, on. Uh, uh. Give it to me, Pierce. Ah. Oh, you got to be tough. Loving is what I got. Hey, I said remember that. Loving is what I got. I said remember that. Remember it. Loving, everybody, is what I got. Come on. I said remember that. Loving is what I got. I got, I got, I got, I got, I got, I got. You can at least smile when you sing it. Come on, man. <laughs> My no, my guitar solo. Thank you. That was a concert. Thank you. Time to go. What the fuck is that thing? Something very pissed off. <laughs> this guy means business. You think? He flipped a fucking car. He on steroids or something? I go with or something. Time to tip on out of here. No job! This line advice comes from everything about me. Don't worry, baby, I got a plan. Oh, I'm down to the a thing. That big fucker was enormous. You know what you think? I've seen some scary motherfuckers, but the way he was shrugging off bullets? Something wasn't right. 
At least he's dead. I hear that. See, baby, I told you this before. It's been five years, we're happy, we're safe, and now we can start that family you were always putting on. The Ronin found us! Some okay, people just can't fight. Aisha, some stars are meant to fall. Rated R in theaters this summer.